So a four inch pipe? Yeah, the four inch pipe. We need two of those. Two it, end caps too. Two so end caps. Two cap. four inch end caps. Those J hooks aren't strong enough. No. We're gonna look for it when we get there. Or ask Bungee them. cords. No. Strap, some kind of strap. Some type of strap. Also chain, you, they rope sometimes slip up, you're loose. But we need something that when you pull it, it latches. Like the like almost like the strap. It latches in place. Once you pull it, how do you pull it? It latches. It doesn't oh, loosen okay. up. Straps then. How much do you think you need across the whole fish tank? Five, probably five, huh? What do you mean across the whole fish tank? We're not doing them across the whole fish tank. We're just going across that wood piece. That lumber piece that's under the fish tank. Right, yeah. that that's connected to all fish all fish tank in the back. The four inch pipe because the water runs all the way down and it goes down and goes in the middle of the sump tank. Yeah. But you, what you talking about strapping it over uh, over the tanks though? It ain't going over. No, no, it's to strap all to make sure it's secure all down the line. Probably we need about five straps to strap it here and then a quarter way and then halfway, 75% away. Yeah, probably it's, right now it's on that one is three. I mean it's one there's about four of them on there. We only need four. We need this, and we need another one of these. We need one of those. Uh, we need another one of those. Let's go. Thank you. Welcome. We need these. We need these. <laughs> Two of these. <laughs> we'll take this. Yep. Okay. Very much, yep. All right, have a good day. You too, thank you very much. Got both of them? Yeah, it's really light. Man, mosquitoes biting. You getting bit by mosquitoes? Yeah, there's a lot of them today. Man, they're all over the place. So, ladies and gentlemen, what we're working on is the seedling tray. It's gonna go into here and it's gonna house our seedling. Inch and a quarter, inch and one quarter hole saw. It might be that one right there, which that has the, the that's our, oh, you just put it into the side, that right, right there. Check on the side of it. Inch and one quarter. That's the one we need right there. A unit seal to put on there. I'll go grab that right now. Let's see if we can find us one of these unit seals lingering around here. We need a three quarter inch unit seal in order to plug it in the bottom of our seedling tray. Let me see if we have any over here. I think we should have some. Yes, we do have some, might I say, right here. We have one here. And we have one here. Boom. Get over here. I'm bug suit tonight. Huh? Tonight for sure. I'm what? buying a bug suit. You buying a bug suit? A bug suit. Is it that bad, man? That's serious. That's crazy, man. I'm buying a bug suit tonight. It'll be delivered the next day. <laughs> I need it. ASAP. <laughs> Okay. You over here? I accept defeat this time with the bugs. <laughs> I'm not strong enough to fight these bugs. I admit it. I gotta sleep thinking about them the next day. <laughs> Are these guys gonna be out next tomorrow? I hope they're not. Yeah, you tomorrow. do. They're taking away my nighttime. <laughs> so if you I get the bugs too, they can't beat me at nighttime when I'm working at nighttime. Let's flip this over until we have our hole, which is on the wrong side. On the wrong side? Yeah. <laughs> it's not the side I wanted it on. It's all right. I just drill another one. I gotta get a flathead. Oh, they stuck in there. We got the piece that's stuck in here. I hate this when this happens. I absolutely hate when this happens. All right, ladies and gentlemen, what the heck do we have here? The new, the improved, the one and only seedling. Okay, I'm just playing, man. This is just another basic seedling tray that we put together. You guys seen us building it? Um, put the liner in here. Got it set up, uh, got as many creases out as possible, there's still some creases in here, no big deal. Um, here we're going to clean this up, put some staples on here, we don't have the staples right now, I can't find the staple gun, it's somewhere around, we either got to buy a new one or, or find it. So we'll staple this up, clean it up, we're not worried about this right now. Um, so let me show you, it just, I'll show you from here, boom, so this is how it goes. We have the filter, the filter's coming up, filtering water, all this is clean, filtered water clean and filtered water and then it comes here we have our uh, valve on here let me open this up for just a little bit open that up just a little bit yeah, comes over here passes makes his way down here and then voila you can see it coming out fills this up 
and it's only gonna maintain probably about a quarter inch to maybe about a half inch of water level in here. So that'll be it. Then we have our T5 lights up here to light the seedlings. Voila! So we have that going, boom. So this is pretty much what it looks like. Place our seedlings in here and get that going. So then once it fills up here, in this uh, outlet here, it'll come down, boom, make its way right on over here, back to where? The infamous sump tank. Ladies and gentlemen, it is placed right above the water level, which is maintained around here. We are getting ready to plant some vegetables in here, and I don't know what I wanna plant. Oh my goodness, man, we might have, I got a variety of seeds that I still haven't planted. They're a little old, germination rate is not gonna be as good as I want it to be, but that's fine. We're gonna go ahead and plant, man. We got some kale. Can't wait to slap my lips on some more kale. We got some Swiss chard. I think, I, am I gonna plant those? I think we might plant some Swiss chard. Let's see, what else do we have? Mustard greens, oh my goodness, man. There's some Japanese mustard greens that I have in here. Woo, I'm telling you right now. If you're a mustard green fan, you will love them. Baby salad greens, my all time favorite. If you get your lips on some of those, man, I'm telling you, might just, mmm, backflip, man. Come on, man, set up easily, nice and easy. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Flow is probably just a little bit too much, or uh, might just be right just on. And you guys can see it return. And that's where it returns, right there. Deviating from the seedling plan. We're now going to get ready to cover this, uh, this sump tank up. We want to block the sunlight from getting in here and contributing to this algae. So we're going to go ahead and place some of this around it and block out that. This is heavy duty, um, heavy duty tarp. The brown color, this is like, um, I think it's an 8 by 16 or something like that. I don't know, a 6, six by 8. You remember the size of it, Carlos? No. Six by eight or something like that. Six by yeah. Six by but it's supposed to fit around. Put two of them on there. Yeah, this is gonna fit nicely. Two inch, okay. two inch, to inch and a half uh, reducer. We need inch and a half elbows. Five of those lights for the um, lamps. Yeah. Uh, neatly. Yeah. And that's it. Okay. They might have those replacement things for the, for the instead of buying the whole frame again. Yeah. You want to check try, check for the replacement? Nah, just buy the whole thing. You want to buy the whole thing? Okay. It's, it's not dependable. Okay. Because we hang it up, it will probably pop again here shortly. No, it's the same thing. I'm saying it's a, it's a brand new socket thing. Oh, brand new socket thing. You got to rewire the whole thing, huh? Um, they yeah, it's too rusted on top anyway. It looks crappy. Oh, okay. It looks yeah. all, it's all jacked up. It's time for a new one. We're in the game now. Step a step back real quick and look at the new Sump Tank. Sump Tank 1000. Get this at the local aquaponic paradise. And uh, so we have just end up wrapping the last piece of this tarp on top of it. Sun is completely blocked off, and we can just come up, lift it up, do what we got to do in there. Boom, sat it back down, and that's it. That is all she wrote, ladies and gentlemen. Theory, is it that serious, man? Yeah, man, the bugs are killing me, man. I'm from California, I'm not used to these bugs <laughs> at all. So, that's actually two of them. <laughs> you got I to it them. together so I get a more <laughs> useful scratch. Oh, that's crazy. So I got two for two for two dollars. So this is the spot though. <laughs>